Enough with all this lackadaisical nonsense, man. It's time to get back to Road to GM, bro. It's time to get back to Road to GM. I'm not playing. My rating's climbing. I'm climbing. This was first game of the day. I'm going to hit 1,500 in a week, man. I'm going to be back there. I might even be there in the next few days. Don't hate. Don't doubt me. But we are creeping. We just hit 1,060 subscribers. I think we can hit 1,100 in the next couple days. So if you're new, hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Drop a comment, you know? You know, let the... Let the YouTube algorithm know that y'all y'all messing with me. So, yeah, without further ado, let's get into this game. My opponent, Sir Ryder, 1405 from, where are we from? The Czech, Czech, Repu Czech, 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 Czech Republic. Um, D4. And I was just learning this new, the England, England Gambit opening where I sacked the queen. Me and Saucy Chess were in the lab a little bit this morning. I was on his live, and we were going through some stuff. But he accepts. In the mix of it, knight c6, he develops, and now I play queen up. And the trap begins if he does some nonsense like these. And I can come in check, either win the bishop or win the pawn. But he develops. He doesn't even let me get the opportunity. So I cash in immediately, take, take. Now he jumps his knight in, threatening a fork, not really because that's guarded. So I just kick him out, get up out of there. He runs, and now I take the full center. Lights, light bishop and dark bishop activated. Them boys activated. He kicks out my queen, but I slide all the way to the left. Queen h5. I'm threatening maybe a queen trade if he offers it. He does offer it. Let's get these queens off the board, my boy. Let's get them off. He takes back with the can. king. I give him a check. He blocks development. And I, I had some sneaky little ideas here. I was like, okay, if he takes... Oh, no, no. If he takes this pawn, I take. He takes. I bring my rook to the party, pinning his knight to his king. And if he takes my bishop, I'll take back. And now I'm threatening a fork, as well as that knight still being, being hanging. And I was thinking that, I was like, okay, please, please do it. He takes first step, activated, take. Then he takes the bishop first. I take back, threatening a fork. So we didn't go down that line, but it's okay. He steps his king up. Now I bring my rook to the party. Defend this pawn. He's still stepping, and I'll just drop back, bro. Ain't no worries. There is no stress, none of that. Check, block with the bishop. He develops his bishop, getting his rook into the party. And I just slide my rook up to d7 so I can castle, get my other rook to the game. <sighs> Let's do it. Let's castle. Bishop out attacking that weak pawn. I just push b6. What did they want me to play? Bishop b4. Bishop b4, bishop b4. Mm, nah. And then he keeps he keeps doing these little these little motions with his bishop, just trying to get his bishop into a good spot. But I'm doubled up on the rook file. Take, take. I doubled up because I was like, okay, if he takes that and this rook isn't here, this pawn's hanging twice. So I had to I had to take that precaution. Take, take. He develops his knight out, and I'm like, let me boot that back. I know that's probably not a good move. He jumps in, knight c5, but I'm like, I can just play rook c7, right? Rook c7, let's do it. Rook x Whoa, 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 he can do that? Rook xd5, because if I take, he got back rank. That's kind of that's kind of a difficult find right there. That's a difficult find. He locks his bishop or his knight in, and now I slide my bishop back. He can't take because it's defended. I'm also threatening bow, bow, winning a pawn. I don't really think that does much, to be honest, so I'm going to take that. Yo, whoa, 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 what just happened? What just happened? What just happened? Whoa, 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 I was going to go stupid. Hold on. Okay. Okay, we here. So I take that knight. He takes back. I take back. My rook patrolling these pawns. Defending it from everywhere. Now he's rook up. Check. Go ahead and run for me. I'm, I'm rook back. I, I got to stay complacent. G3. G6 getting ready for H5 for a check. Yo, this is tripping. It's tripping. It's tripping. It's tripping. Okay, so I played g6, game ready for h5. Did they want me to play 
F5. Ooh, they wanted me to give that check immediately. But he brings his rook to the party, threatening this pawn. I'm like, ah, I want to hold on to that thing. I want to hold on to that thing. I'm going I'm to I'm fork my rooks around. He brings his rook down and um, H5 check, slide back, step with my king. Oh, rook E7 threatening this pawn. But I'm going to just play rook F7, lock it in. I'm the endgame master, oh man. Two rooks, rook endgame, man. Man, I'm locked in. Ten summers. He steps his king up, and that just gives me a free pawn, so I'll take it. He steps back, and he he's good he did step back, because that's mate right there. So he steps back. I'll take that pawn, too. He's rook e8, trying to just do all this and give me some shit, but I play... Hey, rook a3. Nothing crazy, nothing crazy planned. Rook a8, but he's threatening bow, check, here. Or he's threatening this, and then mate. That's what he's threatening. But before, I gotta make a little escape square for my king, don't I? Like, don't I gotta do that? <sighs> take that pawn. You can't take because you, cause you pinned. You can't do that. You cannot take because you pinned so he gets out the way of the pin and now i check slide back rook f2 is problems check i'm running check i'm safe check sack the rook i'll take back oh i should have took with the pawn huh i should have took with the pawn then he goes rook g8 check then i go king f5 Eh, how do you stop it? You can't. But I take with the king. He gives me a check with the pawn. Step. He's running. I'll give him a check. Go back. I'll take that. Check. I'll go back. Check. Damn, I missed the rook hc2. Rook h to c2. Oh, they just wanted me to go here and just give him a ladder mate. But it's okay. I'll take that pawn. Check. Rook trade. It's cool. Let's get that rook trade going. I just wanted to get to the end game so I can push my pawns. Now I'm threatening ladder. Check. I'll step. Defend. I'll push. I'll push. I'll push. I'll push. I'll push. Let's get a rook trade. He don't want it. I'll give to give me a queen. Check. Check. Mate and one. Rook H three. Check. Mate. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Let's do game review. I want to show y'all the line I practiced, bro. I want to show y'all the line I went through. So this, this, and if he played this, I'd go check. He has to block. I take. He goes here. I bring my bishop out. He attacks my queen, and I sack my queen. Check. He blocks with that. I take that pawn, and then he better tread lightly. The best move is rook b3, but say he just does something like this. He's already lost because I just jump in, and you can't really stop this. You can try to do this in castle, but that's if I take that. I'll take this and hit that. You won't be able to move. I'm going to win that. Slide back. It's just going to be bad, bro. But the best move is that and then i gotta go here and then they gotta find queen a1 and do that and then but these are just hard moves to find i gotta defend but that that's just a little line i learned just earlier today they didn't like that what did they want me to do oh bishop out I didn't like that push. I was supposed to protect it, wasn't I? Well, then what if he just... What if he takes? Knight e4. Mm, you take. I take. I take. You take. I take. That's cool. That's cool and all, but I don't really know.
Okay. Okay. Check my day. That's how we do it. 1700. Ooh. Opening 100%. Middle game 85. End game 82. That's how you, I like that. I like that a lot. But that's game one, y'all. Get ready for game two, my boy. Get ready for game two. It's Tuesday. Let's get ready for it, man. Come on. Game two. It's game two, baby. Come on. You know it's a two-game special every single day. We got to do it. D4. D5. Queen's Gambit declined. I'm going to just develop. I'm going to just develop. 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 We can get this bishop trade going if you want. I'll take open rook. I'm cool with that. He goes and pins. And now I push. But now he jumps in. And it's looking kind of sketchy. I'm not going to lie. It's looking a little sketch. What do I play, though? Queen. Oh, I jumped my knight in. I'm not even worried about this. I don't care. I'm like, take it. Take it. He takes queen b3. I'm threatening some shit. It's, it's a little treacherous here. He takes knight a2 with discovered check, but now two pieces are hanging, and I'll just step up, remember? I'll just step up. He kicks out my knight. I take that knight, and now I'm like, okay, you can take. I'll take right back. Get my piece back, but he develops his knight to defend it. I drop my knight back. He takes the pawn. I take back with my queen. Now he brings his bishop back. Knight h4, get after the bishop, top engine move. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay. What? Queen x e6 check? Oh my god, that could have picked up the bishop, right? Check, or I guess he'd have to block. Nah, fuck it. I kick out the bishop. He slides back, fork at me. I give him a check. He goes back. And now I blender a fork again. Oh, my God. It's looking so bad. Like, look at this. How I... Ah, a goddamn skewer. And then a goddamn fork. Oh, my God. Take my rook. I don't care. He takes my rook. I take that pawn with check. Defends with his bishop. And now I back up and get the knight. So I'm down two points of material, but it's okay. He gives me a check. I slide out the way. Thank you for taking my bishop, bro. Because now my rook, my rook was so passive back there, I was going to have to take king out the way, bishop out the way before I could get my rook in. But now you gave me a check, I slide out the way, and then you took my bishop and I take with my rook and my rook's activated. Hey! He's pushing. That's just a free pawn. Truly just a free pawn. You can't even castle because, oh, oh, long money sniper. My queen. My queen. He brings his bishop out, and I'm check with it. He blocks with the queen. Hey, yo. Why you blocking with the queen? You thought that I was going to trade queens? You thought I was going to trade queens? Gore the God Butcher thought I was going to trade queens? No, 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 no. Give me that. He takes. And now I take that pawn. Let's get spunky. King over. Check. Block. Check. Run, check, he's running, check, okay, I want him back there though, now I'm king over, getting ready to get my rook into the shmuffin party, bishop back, he kicks me out, I'll slide all the way back, it's cool, I'll slide all the way back, man, I'll slide all the way back, rook up, rook over, push, check, run, check, huh, give me the rook, huh, huh, give me the check, and now I'm bishop in. Let's go. Take the bishop. I'm taking back and you cannot stop, mate. That is exactly what happens. I give him checkmate. <laughs> On your dome. Peace. I play 74.5. Not my best. 1450. It's cool. They don't like that. Okay. Damn, where do they want me to go? Mm. Jesus 
get that there. Damn. Okay. Okay, it happens, check. Damn, what? There need check here. Check here. Get the queen? I don't know. Give me that. Now we hit a little shuffle, 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 shuffle. We do this, man. We do this. We do this. We do this. GG's in the chat to my kid, to my boy. GG's in the chat to my boy. And that's the end of the video, yo. If y'all made it this far, drop a like, drop a subscribe if y'all new, and I'll catch y'all in the next one, man. Deuces.